We can use a carousel to view a series of images sequentially, as if it were an animation. To create one, click on the carousel icon in the content item bar and then on any point of the page. To edit the images, we double-click on the carousel. We can open this same window by using the properties. Click on Edit the Carousel. We have to click on the Add Image icon in the Carousel Image Editor to include as many pictures as we want. Use the arrows to change the order of the images. If there is an image that we do not want to display, we only have to remove it from the sequence. The time field allows us to define, in milliseconds, the time that elapses between an image and the next. 1000 milliseconds is equivalent to one second. We can also change the time for a given image. Once we have already set a sequence, press OK to close the window. Now we move on to see other properties. As we have already seen with the images, the tooltip field allows us to write a short explanatory text that appears when you hover over the image, and in alternative text, we can enter text to be displayed in browsers with disabled images. The Auto Run field allows the sequence to start automatically when the page loads. If we deactivate it, an action will be necessary to start the carousel. In the field, Infinite Loop is activated. The sequence is reproduced indefinitely. We have to disable it if we want to indicate the indicated number of loops. The Image Bounds field allows us to recover the original size of the first image in case we have given it a different one. Finally, place the carousel in its correct position on the page and preview the result.